Welcome to episode 1471 of the Multifamily Collective. Creeping up on 1500. That's crazy. Um, today I wanted to talk about can't and don't. Uh, if you're anything like me, from time to time you say, I can't do that, or I'm not good at that, or I'm too old for that. And what you do when you say things like that is that you implant in your mind a trigger, so to speak, or a prompt, so to speak to go out and find things out in the world, confirmation bias, so to speak, and you attract those things into your life. Your, your mind literally goes to work, your brain literally goes to work to find things to back up those statements that you make. So to get more candid with ourselves, instead of saying, I can't do that, you could say something like, I don't like to do that, <laughs> or that is not something that brings me joy, or just switch up the language so that you're not triggering your brain to go out and find reasons why you can't do something or you're too old to do something. You got to shift that language around and make it more affirmative in nature and or just a conscious, absolute choice not to do something, not to be interested in it because it doesn't align with a value system or because it doesn't bring you joy. It doesn't bring you happiness. It doesn't give cause for good relationships in your life. That is a reason to shift that language so that the outcome is different for you. Take care. We'll talk to you again soon.